okay after discussing the definition of set we move on to notations of set how can you denote it the sets are usually denoted by the capital letters a comma b so we are usually indicating it as capital letters a or b etc x y z anything can be defined right and the members of the sets the elements which are inside the set members or elements you call of the set are denoted by lower case letters for example uh, collection of flowers and nanu f anta denote madidre that f outside you can write okay so you can say capital f be the uh, set but if i write say if i write uh, uh, collection of flowers in a garden by capital f the elements inside the sets are followed by within flower bracket say red rose or yellow rose y white rose w likewise so the sets denoted by capital letters elements are members of the set denoted by the small letters lower case okay if x is a member of the set a we write x belongs to a this symbol is called belongs to belongs to a read it as belongs to a and if x is not a member of the set a we write it x does not belongs to a this symbol is does not belongs to a say so for example in this uh, set r belongs to f r is an element of the set f so we denote it by r belongs to f we can call by the, this symbol you can denote r belongs to f but t in this set t is not present therefore t does not belongs to f that can be indicated as t does not belongs to the set f we can write so there is a, a important uh, notation while writing elements belongs to the set or not okay next we move on to representation of a set how can we represent the set there are two important form to represent the set one is called row star form and other one is called set builder form see row star form is also called as tabular form and set builder form is also called as rule method okay row star form and uh set builder form okay roster form means we list all the members of the set within braces within brackets and elements are separated by commas for example if i want to denote the set a of all odd natural numbers less than 10 in the roster form roster form is also called as tabular form so tabular form set a is 1 3 5 7 9 we can see this is all odd natural numbers less than 10 i have taken okay if you want to denote one collection which containing elements which are less than odd natural number which are less than 10 can be denoted in the set by using roster form representation is this 1 3 5 7 9 this is called roster form representation are also called as tabular form got it in roster form every element of the set is listed only once only once say somewhere while writing these elements may appear repeatedly therefore no need to write repeated uh, elements 1 comma 1 no need to write or somewhere 3 here again after 9 writing 3 is meaningless in set you should write element only one times the element every element of the set is listed only once it should not be repeated got it the order in which the element are listed is immaterial see the order of the elements writing 1 3 5 7 9 is same as 9 7 5 3 1 you can list it anyway the order of the elements are uh, is immaterial elsewhere you can place the elements got it say for example i have one example here 1 2 3 elements this is a set we can either write this as 1 2 3 3 or 3 2 1 1 3 2 1 you can write in any form but every element should followed by commas and entire set should be placed within flower brackets these are the important conditions and element should not be repeated there is an idea of representing set in roster form also called as tabular method one more is set builder form we can represent the set in other method is called set builder form in this method we write a variable say x 
representing any member of the set followed by a property satisfied by each member of the set satisfied by the each member of the set means you can see the same example but i have taken here some set of all prime numbers less than 10 in the set builder form i have one example set of all prime numbers i have to represent it in the set builder form okay this is set builder form how you define x that is variable i said we write a variable say x representing any member of the set followed by property so yava property mele ee set define agutte annu nanu helbeku variable x is such that this is such that indication such that x is a prime number less than 10 this is set i would like to explain x is a prime number less than 10 anta helo set anna idu set builder form alli bariyodu ondu general variable x anta barbittu adara conditions anna list madidra aithu ide example anna neevu roster form nalli baradre andre first method tabular form nalli baradre 2357 agutte andre elements followed by comma and write within the flower bracket because prime number less than 10 means first prime number is 2 positive prime number next is 3 5 7 less than 10 we said so 7 is the last prime number less than 10 therefore representing these two uh, in the form of set builder form as well as uh, our tabular method 